North Korea has warned Donald Trump any U.S. military action would lead to the, the most tragic end for the American empire as World War III fears deepen. Pyongyang vowed not to stand by while Donald Trump makes harsh statements against the regime after the U.S. president threatened to totally destroy North Korea. Last week Trump used his U.N. speech to warn Kim Jong-un that the United States would defend itself and its allies. He said, if it is forced to defend ourselves or our allies, we will have no choice but to totally destroy North Korea. The United Nations speech also outlined the most serious round of sanctions against the North Korean regime yet. Now the rogue state have claimed they will seriously review taking the strongest ever response measure after the president's speech and a controversial show of strength from the U.S. military. U.S. bombers flew closer to North Korea than any other American jet has in the 21st century while flying over international waters on Saturday, the Pentagon said. Pentagon spokeswoman Dana White said, This mission is a demonstration of U.S. resolve and a clear message that the president has many military options to defeat any threat. We are prepared to use the full range of military capabilities to defend the U.S. homeland and our allies. Tensions have intensified since Mr. Trump's speech in which he labeled Mr. Jong Un rocket man. The dictator responded by saying he may consider a hydrogen bomb test in the Pacific Ocean. Mr. Trump then appeared to threaten regime change in the isolated communist country when he said Kim Jong Un would not be around much longer. In a statement, North Korea's warmongering peace committee said, if the U.S. misunderstands our power and willingness and pushes ahead with a reckless military option, it will lead to the most tragic end for the American empire. The statement also warned, North Korea will seriously review taking the strongest ever response measure and our top leadership's bombshell declaration to deal with the U.S. dotard with fire should not be overlooked. It follows an explosive statement from the young dictator himself last week. Kim Jong-un said, now that Trump has denied the existence of an insulted me and my country in front of the eyes of the world and made the most ferocious declaration of a war in history that he would destroy the DPRK. Publish in express.co.uk
Shockwave! Brace! These are getting scarcer than hen's teeth. You shouldn't have stayed out so long looking. Well, I only need one for the short wave. Oh, I'll go and blow myself work. up. I'm not sure about any. Red is positive. Here it comes. <laughs> <laughs> 